Hi guys, hello, hi, 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 welcome back to my channel, it's Mommy T Squad TV again, welcome back guys, so firstly guys, I want to say very big thank you for my 500 subscribers, yay! we made it yeah guys please guys keep subscribing like i always say subscribing costs nothing guys keep subscribing to mommy t squad tv yo guys welcome back to my channel once again today we are going to be cooking Orish Orish stew, tomato stew. So, guys, as you can see, with me here, yeah, my recipe, I have my tomato. So, uh, this is um, plum tomatoes, well steamed already. So, I have steamed it, as you can see. Now, no water in it it's well steamed so guys and again i have here with me my um bell pepper so i just blended everything i'm sorry i could not bring you guys when doing all that because i have to save a little bit time you know so yeah i have the bell pepper scotch bonnet onions and uh, <clears throat> yeah that's what i have here onion scotch bonnet and the bell pepper so they are all blended here so i didn't bother to um, steam it together because sometimes when you have just steaming trying to steam the bell pepper the more water will be coming out so it's better you just fry it like that so that's my own method of cooking so guys yeah and uh yeah i have my fish is wet dried up already so normally i used to cook my uh, uh, tomato stew with hair fish but so unfortunately there's no egg fish at the moment and uh yeah i'm using the macro fish as you can see is well dried up here and um i also have here with me my shaki parboiled shaki and uh basically i'm using assorted just name it anything you can think of they are all here i have the fuku the ring um uh kidney tongue just name it i have everything here basically it's all assorted and here i also have the my goat meat uh, uh, i also have the what is it called? Ishan. We normally call it Ishan. Pardon me, guys. So I don't know the name in English. So we, the Beninese, we normally call it Ishan. So, and I also have the cow tea. And I have a little bit of goat meat, beef meat. And, uh, yeah. Basically, it's just a sorted stew. Orishi, orishi, a sorted stew. Yeah, I also have my pomo cow skin, popularly known as pomo, guys, as you can see. And I have here my diced onions. So you can see everything is ready, ready. So guys, and yeah, I have... And these are the ingredients I use to and steam my meat so i use curry powder um ginger powder and nutmeg powder as you can see so i just decided to bring it out so that when i'm when i'm explaining what i use the stuff i use so that you guys will be able to understand me so guys these are the ingredients i use to steam my meat so for the tomato I usually use this as well to season my tomato before I steam it, guys. So, I basically, I got this whole store from Nigeria. 
guys and this i will be using for my stew and my seasoning cube as well as well as my shorts of course shorts here yeah. so guys let's get started thank you guys and stay tuned with mommy t squad tv so guys welcome back to mommy t squads so now as you can see guys the next step is frying our tomato now as you can see the oil is already bringing out smoke the oil is hot enough all i have to do now is to go ahead and pour my onions in the so Onions in the oil. Yeah. Hey, but they just they do me chicky 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 chicky. So guys, next now is to pour my tomato. Yo guys, as you can see, a tomato is inside. Okay. Next, now I have to go ahead and pour my shaki inside because the shaki was parboiled and uh, it's a bit strong. So, the shaki is inside now, and I will also add the ishion to it so that it will be soft. You know, ishion now. It's very strong if you don't cook it properly it's very difficult to eat so guys i'm just put in my asian and a light cook yeah guys so let's look at what we have in our cooking pot yo yeah we are Mm. here we go so this is the look for now still is still cooking still cooking we are still waiting for the water to dry to dry up mm. as you can see it's a bit watering it's because of the bear pepper no, I told you earlier but anyway it's going to dry it up so we just have to have a little bit patience 10 minutes our stew will be ready so this is the look for now and our um, meat just stay here so the momo because the momo is a bit soft so i don't want to add it now and our fish of course is still there so i don't want to add it now so that it's too good it's too good and broken you know so this is it for now this is the look orange orange and eh? a sorted stew so guys stay tuned yeah guys let's see what we have in our pot so wow wow this is the final look basically i have everything inside now fish momo everything they are all inside so so guys this is our final final look of our today kitchen assorted orish orish stew Mm -hmm. guys so i will still have to cover let's say five minutes time we will be ready to eat with rice that's my rice there with rice oh my god this still look so yummy and it tastes so yummy wow guys this stew is unbelievable. So yummy. Mm. 
so guys once again i want to say a very big thank you to all my subscribers so far cheers to 500 subscription wow i'm so happy today really i'm really happy thank you guys for your sus for your subscription so far thank you and god bless please guys if you've not subscribed to mommy t squad tv kindly subscribe to my channel and uh, don't forget to hit on the no notification bell so that anytime when i upload a video you will be the first to be notified yeah and if you find this video interesting guys why not give it a thumbs up wow so guys this is it our orish orish is still so guys thank you all for watching and god bless have a nice evening until i come your way in my next video stay blessed